attacking the adductors. He's gonna be working on kind of that. Everybody, it's Eric Johnson for Airtay Throws Nation. Thanks so much for checking out this video. What we're going to do is we are going to go through our warm up routines. One of the things that we normally talk about with our young throwers is that they tend to pride themselves on not running. That's one of the things that we see with our throwers doing, and we need to know that our throwers need to do an extensive amount of warm up. Warm up is going to help with some general fitness level work capacity, but it's also going to develop coordination, and that's going to be a really important thing. Obviously, get thoroughly prepared for training whether that's hitting the gym or hitting our throws in the ring so one of the things we're gonna do today is we're gonna go through our four warm-up routines that we discussed and we're gonna have Jason demo our basic first movement and the first thing is just gonna be back and forth we're gonna be doing side shuffles skips hops hip rotations lunges we're gonna do all these sorts of things we'll set up usually anywhere from six to ten exercises and we're gonna repeat those things two to three times so the warm-up should last anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes so that the athlete is breaking a good sweat okay so Jason's gonna start out we're gonna do a real simple routine he's just gonna kind of come from here he's gonna kind of go back and forth so we're gonna start out with a side shuffle real simple and he likes to incorporate his arms which is good and what you want to see is your athletes getting tall a lot of times the athletes come out of basketball and they do the low kind of shuffle side shuffle and we're going to do more of a rhythmical up down elongated movement now the next movement we're going to do is a simple skip we're going to have it jason kind of just hopping up and he's just going to get a good little pop up and he's going to be utilizing the arms engaging the core working the hip flexors working through the feet super easy um, super effective and again it's just working general coordination you're going to notice that your athletes are going to be out of position a lot of times you're going to see their feet externally rotating and what you're trying to do is maintain good vertical lines good strong posture as we're doing these movements next thing we'll do is a karaoke okay so go ahead and so what we'll do is we'll again have Jason working on uh, at attacking the adductors He's gonna be working on kind of that rotation, creating that separation that we'll actually kind of see in our rotational throws, even of our glide shot. And now the next thing we'll do is we'll just do a backward hip rotation. So Jay's just gonna go walk right into one hip rotation after the next. And so you're gonna see where he's gonna kind of create a big circle. So he's gonna go backwards, and then what he's gonna do is move forwards into the throw. Okay, so he'll come around, you get the idea. And so this is kind of the, your, your breather moment. B skips again always require a little bit of more coordination so you're going to see how he's going to be here and there's a little extra extension so as he hops he's going to be doing that getting that hamstring engaged and here he comes back good now there's really no limit on the amount of movements that you can do what we tend to do again we tend to keep it around six to eight and then we're going to repeat that so we probably go about 25 meters so it's it's 50 meters per if they do that if you're doing eight right you're doing 400 meters of that you do that two to three times you're going to have a really good physical warm-up so again this is just a good variety of movement again the variation just helps your athletes break a sweat work coordination get the hips moving the feet moving the shoulders moving work on coordination tightening the core and that's really what our primary focus is we want to get that good warm-up for to prepare for good training sessions in the weight room and in the ring all right guys thanks for watching next exercise coming up